All right. Now we're doing Freight Code Camp, JavaScript algorithms and data structures, basic JavaScript, passing values to functions with arguments. So parameters are value, pardon me, are variables that act as placeholders for the values that are to be input to a function when it is called. Okay. Uh, when a function is defined, it is typically defined along with one or more parameters. The actual values that are input or passed into a function when it is called are known as arguments. So here's a function with two parameters, parameter one and parameter two. So we've got, we're calling the function right here or defining the function right here. Uh, and then we're going to call it test fun. And then we're going to have parameter one and parameter two in it. And then for the function itself, we're going to say console.log parameter one and parameter two. We'll just, we'll just put this, whatever we put in as parameters into the console like that. So here we go. Then we call test fun like this, test fun, and then we'll have hello and world like that. And we have passed two string arguments, hello and world. Inside the function, parameter one will equal the string hello, and parameter two will equal the string world. Note that we can call test fun again with different arguments and the parameters would take on the values of the new arguments. Okay. So now we're going to create a function called function with args that accepts two arguments and outputs their sum to the dev console. And then we'll call the function with two arguments at, pardon me, two numbers as arguments. Okay. So what we're going to do here is take this, copy it, drop it off right here. And we're going to call it something else. Let's get this function with args, copy this, drop it off here. Uh, param1, param2 is fine for now. Uh, but right here, let's say console.log param1. Instead of comma, we'll say param1 plus param2 like that. And then down here, we'll say, uh, let's say function with args. So let's copy this. Let's drop it off here. Let's have this uh, set of parentheses. And inside here for parameter one, we'll say three, and then we'll say comma four for parameter two. And that gives us seven because three plus four is gonna be put into the console right here. Hopefully that makes sense. So let's run the test. Looks good and submit it. All right, now we're on to return a value from a function with return. And we'll see you next time.